All right, gang, how you doing? You know, I've got a tune here, it's made up all sorts of parts. I like to do things in colours to make it more visual so you can see where I'm going. The wee white bit, it's the wee white bit at the very beginning there, that's usually just like a wee click and track, and then I normally just mute that and leave it. And then obviously you have verses, etc. Now there comes a point where you want to pop a marker, just to know where things are. And these wee things here at the top there, they're, they're my markers. Now, you can put them up and they normally come in as numbers and you get them down the side here. So just make sure you've got the wee panel at the side of them. Uh, and, and if you want to bring in a marker, and the thing is, if you want to name the marker, so what we do first is, down to the bottom here, and just as, as you're going to add a track, where is it? Uh, it's down there, there it's here. Add a marker track. Now, I've already got one, you can see at the top. So you would just click on that and this would appear up here. And what we've got here is, uh, you've got a wee white tablet come up. And you've got over here at the four sides, you've got like a, a wee plus sign and you've got another wee sign. I just normally just use the first one. And each time you click that, it comes up with a new marker and it'll add a new marker. But it, de it depends where you, you uh, put it right there. It's put number 14. So I'm going to undo that. I'll just undo that and I'll move, I'll move it to there. And we'll say marker. I should have done that first. There you go. It's putting a wee number 14 there. I don't need it. This is just a wee bit of music I was messing about with further further in in the song, or closer in in the song, I'm just experimenting, I didn't want to delete it, so I just can move it there and then I'll just make it white, well I'm technically I'm using the wee, the wee cross so you kind of hear it, just a wee thing I like to keep, but anyway we've got a wee 14 marker here, and it's actually appeared down here, now I always thought you could click in there and get its name, but you can't actually get its name, you can actually type in a name there, but as soon as you hit return key you just <laughs> can't see it, so we, we couldn't really change these names here, but what you need to do is click on the wee letter E, and this wee window will come up. And then you've got them all there. And you, you just get into this part here where it says description. And that, there's the 14 one. And if I type in there, I'll do a bit of gobbledygook. And we'll hit return. And as you can see up there, V14's got that. So that's how you create your markers. And I, I've got this open down at the bottom here. You can you, you can mess about with this Cubase and always. And it puts markers here, there. Or you can put them up here. I've got them down here at the bottom. So whatever one of these ones you click on, it will automatically jump back to it, and the exact same applies here. The only thing is, the one that annoys me about this site here is you need to get right out of the corner and click there. You kind of just click there, like I say, you think if you could click on that and it go highlights, you can actually name it in there, but it doesn't let you name it in there. I'll show you, I'll do a bit of gobbledygook, hit return key, boom, it's just went back to none. So even if you click in there, it's not moving the marker. You need to get right into the corner to move that bloody thing along. Whereas if you go right down there, you just click on it and it moves it along. So, if you want to create markers, that's how you create markers. It's good It's good if you're working on a part of a song. I'm working on a part of a song, whereas I need to finish a lyric. I'm not even started lyrics on this crank wee tune. I quite like this. Uh, and I need to get the lyrics now as a wee tricky syllable in the, the song that's not quite right. You know, we all get a song where the lyrics just a bit too long and the syllable's killing us and we just can't find it and fix it. Well, I've got a few wee parts in this song before I even start doing any vocals. And... And it just annoyed me then, I'm going, why is that just that? Why can't I change it? Because all versions done that. So that's how you do it. Oh, by the way, Happy New Year, you scumbags. <laughs>